Hello guys, this is Saad and welcome to my channel. In this video I'll be telling you how to fix Windows 11 screen flickering or flashing. So let's begin. First of all you have to go to start and then search. Over here you have to type in device manager. Now you'll have to select display drivers over here. You'll have to uninstall it and then reinstall it again. But you'll have to make sure you have a stable Wi-Fi connection because if you don't have Wi-Fi connection, you may not be able to reinstall it again and your display may not be fixed. So to uninstall it, you have to right click on it and then click on uninstall device. Then you'll have to click on uninstall. After uninstalling it, you'll have to click over here scan for hardware changes. As you can see the display has been installed again. It is visible over here now. Now you'll have to go again to the same app device manager and then you'll have to go to the same place repeat the same thing except you'll have to click on update driver now so you'll have to right click on your graphics card and then click on update driver now you'll have to click on search automatically for drivers as you can see for me already the latest version has been installed but for you maybe due to the not latest version installed on your PC your graphics card may not be working properly so after you update your driver, your latest version may be installed and this could actually fix your problem. For the next fix, you'll have to open run. To open run, just go to start and type in run. You can even open run by clicking the Windows key and R together. Over here, you'll have to type in M MN config and then you'll have to click on OK. Now you'll have to click on services. Over here you'll have to scroll down and then find Windows error, error reporting service. So as you can see I found it now Windows error reporting service. Now you'll have to uncheck the box and then hit apply. Now you'll have to find problem reports and solutions and then you'll have to even uncheck that too. As you can see I found problem reports control panel support. Now you'll have to uncheck this box and then hit apply and then click OK. After this you'll have to restart your computer as you can see over here. Hope this video will have helped you for more similar videos you can subscribe to our channel. We'll meet in the next video till then peace out.